In India, genomic technology will change patients' lives by giving them the ability and access to make health-based decisions using their own genome for information. In India, genomics can improve patients' lives in the next five to 10 years, really by improving access for these technologies to all patients, whether it be dealing with infectious diseases, cancer, or lifestyle diseases like cardiovascular disease. When we look at a personalized medicine today in oncology, unlike in the past, we believe each individual patient is different. How do we treat and how do we manage? And that is where the genomics plays a very important role. India is a country with about 1.4 billion population. We have 100 million rare diseases, uh, 30 million births every year. There are millions of cancer patients. So um, I don't see there is any better place in the world where genomics can make much better impact than in India. The only way to diagnose rare disease is with the help of genomics. Uh, the only way to really treat cancer effectively is with the help of genomics. The genomic solutions today provide an avenue where you could uh, use uh, these technologies to actually find the cause of these rare genetic diseases right at birth. In our mission, Illumina's genome sequencing solutions, especially what we use in XSeq, helps us provide a rapid answer to newborns and pregnant women in the country. So we have been using all the facets of Illumina machines from its first footprint in India in 2007, and it is continuing till date. We almost use every sequencer. It's there on the portfolio of Illumina. Start from simple MySeq to today NovaSeq X+. I think this kind of individualized, uh, personalized care to the patient, looking at the genomics and maybe future omics will help us to treat the patient right first time so we can get a good outcome and prevent recurrences in cancer. Democratized sequencing makes sequencing and the proofs of genomics accessible to all in the process, reduce mortality, morbidity. How do we enable a billion sequences for India in the next decade? That's a big question because the kind of infrastructure, the kind of knowledge base, the kind of uh, manpower required for this would actually solve the world's large problem, not only for India, but we would be providing solutions to a large chunk of this uh, world population.